the campaign is expect to see more police on the roads and on your screens. They were talking about the push starting today for Click It or Ticket. Yeah, 7 Action News reporter Matthew Smith is live in Southfield with more on this. What's new about this, Matthew? Well, certainly the look and feel of the campaign. You know, for years, police have warned that this buckling your seatbelt, it can reduce the risk of dying in a crash by 45%. But here's the thing. This time around, they're also tugging at the heartstrings. A not so subtle reminder that buckling your seatbelt can save a life. Because three out of four people ejected from a vehicle in a crash will die. If you don't do it for yourself, do it for us. This is just one of the campaigns you're going to be seeing. It's called a ticket from us. Now, here's the thing. It's not just the TV ads. You'll see more police on the street starting today. Uh, police around the area are kicking off what's known as a high visibility campaign. That means more police and a push to specifically keep an eye on whether you're wearing that seatbelt. And this is a time of year police specifically don't want you to be missing out. Uh, Note police released statistics at the Memorial Day period last year. They saw the run this campaign. Well, they watched 19 people killed due to traffic crashes. That is a huge spike from years past, and they want to see a reversal. Uh, out here in Southfield, where I am this morning, we know there's going to be more police. The chief noting, quote, if the enforcement crackdown wakes people up to the dangers of unrestrained driving, we'll consider our mission to be a success. If you know a friend or a family member who does not buckle up, please ask them to consider changing their habits. Uh, don't forget that this includes back seats as well. Anytime you buckle a seatbelt, you are reducing the risk of you dying in a car crash. But we're also going to know there are specific laws that are different from state to state. So if you're new to the area or just need to brush up, I'm putting all that information over on our website at WXYZ.com. Bottom line, from now until June 2nd, extra police on the road and they will be cracking down. That means a $65 ticket for not wearing your seatbelt in the front seat. We're live in Southfield this morning. Matthew Smith, 7 Action News. Especially with the holiday weekend approaching, it means saving lives.